Monday and, and the meat aisle's just been devastated. We'll, we'll check the prices as we go along here. Let me just scan it and take a look at this. <laughs> but they still haven't put anything out here. <laughs> Nothing has been put out yet. And, and you can just go along the chicken aisle. Where are the, where are the chickens? There isn't, there isn't a single... Well, there is, there's a single piece right there, leg quarters. But it's just been wiped out. Then you get to the, the processed foods and, and nobody wants those. They just want to come down here to this stuff. But look at the chicken just completely wiped out. There isn't any, anything to look at. $16.84 for raw almond butter for this little tiny thing. Holy smolies, it's crazy. $6.12 for Lord of Dunes. Can you believe that? That's nuts. Oh. Pinwheels, $6.24. Are you kidding me? For cookies, look. $6.24, that's nuts. Well, today is Sunday. We're at Walmart. This is the last day of the month, and uh, we're coming into Walmart. Check prices and see how the store is wrecked. It's always wrecked at the end of the month, so uh, let's head in. Well, actually, we're in, so uh, let's have some fun. I, I noticed when I walked right in here, these little candy bars here now, 2.8 ounces, $2.12 for these things. M&Ms, the Crunchies, the Snickers. Oh, the Snickers are a buck ninety-eight. That's not too bad, right? <laughs> Two dollars for a candy bar. Now here are all their hot foods, and and it's picked over here because it's Sunday, Sunday evening, and there's the prices right there. Six bone-in wings, six dollars and eighty-seven cents. So it's over a dollar a wing, but picked over already. Limes here. This this bag of limes. Four to four four. Look at this little tiny bag of limes. A little tiny bag of limes like this for four dollars and eighty cents. Eight four dollars and ninety-eight cents for a little tiny bag of limes. <laughs> That's not very much. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. And how much are the three ninety-two for the lemons? Three ninety-two for these lemons. Oh, but they're monsters. Oh my gosh, look at that. That's a, that's a big lemon. Looks like you get five of them in there. And. Um, that's that's the price of lemons, my gosh! But the limes, that's crazy. Am I, am I seeing things here? Are there pears for three dollars and ninety-eight cents? And oh, they're looking really healthy, aren't they? <laughs> three dollars and ninety-eight cents. Is that the right one, or are they here? Maybe they're these guys, or is it the package? It might be the package. So let's just see. Bosk three. That's it. That's the package, three ninety-eight. But these guys are. Bulk, two twenty-seven a pound. Two twenty-seven a pound. Oh, jeez! My gosh! Let's look at the Honeycrisp apples. Two eighty-three for the Honeycrisp. It's expensive, and and look at these apples. They're they're not the best quality. What do you think? What do you think for two dollars and eighty-three cents? And uh, what else you have? Envy, two dollars and fifty-four cents for these apples. Uh, I don't envy the price of apples. Oh, jeez! Ambrosia Bulk, $1.98. Cosmic, my wife always buys the Cosmic. <laughs> oh, they're out of sight. <laughs> $2.38 a pound. And look at look at the apples, how they're, they're all abused here. They're abused apples. And here's some Fuji apples, Bulk. And I, I like the Fujis here. $1.86 um, a pound for the apples. And the red apples right here that I buy for my, whoa, I, geez, I buy for my parrot. These red apples here, the red back, red delicious, dollar sixty-eight. That's about it. That's not too bad. They used to be a dollar, but those days are gone. Some of these uh, uh, Marie Ranch dressings, I really like. The, I, don't, I don't know if you've ever tried it, but they're just delicious. But they're three ninety-eight. A lot of the stuff is super expensive up here. Three seventy-eight, three seventy-eight. Even this pomegranate, which I really love, is three dollars and fifty-four cents. And um, here's the bigger Marie's Ranch. This is just some delicious stuff. $5.98, $5.76 for this. Just even some of the, these are the refrigerated section. The stuff's falling all over the place. Salsa, fresh salsa. I guess it's not too bad. $3.43, right? This looks really good. $3.83. I remember these used to be used to be $2 at Publix. The same stuff. The salsa with fresh cilantro on it. Almost $4 for this little tiny container now come on everything is so expensive look at look at this fresh avocado 298 in this avocado right here it's called or guacamole I'm sorry yeah well guacamole that is some avocado uh, 
523 for this 523 just crazy and here's one 318 but look at look at it smaller it's smaller than this and that's 383 so that's what you get they all look good but look at the prices those don't look good at all and look at some of the salads here 398 for the snap peas broccoli slaw 398 for this of course it's organic 288 for some of the uh, cauliflower 347 for these little tiny salads look at these little tiny salads 347 you get about a quarter of an egg in there what's oh, a quail egg <laughs> just crazy 428 347 salad kits 398 374 398 Look at the prices on this. A shredded iceberg lettuce. $1.98 for this. Eight ounces of it. Oh, oh, oh. Holy smolies. Just ridiculous. Oh, I thought this was cute right here. Um, little tiny thing of uh, chopped parsley here. Is this $4.38? The cilantro goes over here. That's $4.38, and that one's that price. Can you believe that? Holy smolies. That's just nuts. Here's some crazy prices on on marshmallow treats six dollars and 47 cents for this 18 18 ounces kind of crazy and just sugar cookies right here now you have to ask yourself are these really worth six dollars and 47 cents you have to ask yourself that i don't know about that seven dollars and 68 cents for the honey honey bun cakes right here my gosh they they look good the variety cake but seven dollars and 68 cents these should be well under five dollars they should be four dollars or something like that 3.98 for these kinds of cookies right here well they i don't know jeez <laughs> three dollars and 98 cents my gosh 5.87 for six cookies here at walmart oh my gosh <laughs> it looks like the seafood department's been kind of wiped out here's a product of canada there's snow crab legs how much are these guys right here fourteen dollars and thirty four cents is what it looks like just for that that's all you get for almost fifteen bucks oh my gosh oh tilapia anytime you see fish on sale mark down oh it says sell by the 30th that's today 6.99 only good tonight <laughs> my gosh like i said anytime i see mark down fish I steer clear of it. <laughs> Swim away. Yellowfin tuna. It's sell by the 30th. It doesn't even look red anymore. My gosh. It's just been wiped out. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Here's my fat boys. $8.24. What was the price at the uh, at uh, Sam's? It was a lot cheaper. You get 12 here. I'll have to go back at the video, but 12 fat boys for for eight dollars and 24 cents i know i know it's a lot cheaper for a lot more but that's what the fat boys are here i just love that name steakums remember these things ten dollars and 56 cents and it's 31 ounces could that be right could this be 21 steaks could that be right that's not too bad i remember these that might not be too bad right here and steakums here this is a little pricey for for just one pound five ounces and here is one pound 15.5 ounces this is a better bargain that might not be too bad ten dollars and 56 cents and then you see this sea pack shrimp scampi look at this 12 ounces seven dollars and 48 cents holy smolies then you look at some of these and i like these butterfly shrimp right here ten dollars and 24 cents i like these you fry them in a little bit of oil with some uh you dip them in butter and they're really good oh and then the coconut shrimp ten dollars and 24 cents i like these 18 ounces i think it's a little pricey but they're really delicious family that's family size 18 ounces must have a small family <laughs> here's these kodiak i've seen these before uh, kodiak power waffles five dollars and 48 cents for for 10 ounces of these guys protein pack power flapjacks i like the name flapjacks remember the movie uh a groundhog day with uh, bill murray and he said i want some flapjacks <laughs> that was funny thick and fluffy power waffles 628 for these guys oh they're blueberry and you get uh, 14 ounces for 628 that's a little pricey 
then right next to that I see real good. Oh, <laughs> the price isn't real good though. Seven dollars and sixty-six cents for fifteen ounces. Four count. Four of these guys for seven sixty-six. Then you get reds. Oh, that's keto friendly. What's keto anyway? Nine, it's, I know what it is. It's nine ninety-seven. That's what it is. A four pack of these guys, hundred and eleven grams each. Oh my gosh. What is it? Oh, they hide it. It's 15.7 ounces for $10. Holy smolies! Am I seeing something right? $5.12? That can't be right, can it? This can't be $5. Well, I guess, I guess it could be. $6.96? That's it. This is $5.12 for 7 ounces. Holy smolies! Hoo -hoo -hoo. That's pricey. Now these are all gluten free. It looks like gluten free pizza. So look at let's look at the uh, not free price of them. $7.48 for this. And it's um, how many ounces is this one? 10 ounces. Right here, nut free pesto pizza. Remember these are all gluten free. 14.3 ounces. I still don't know what it is. Kali Power, $6.98, $6.98, $8.30, for this pizza for 13 ounces, $6.98 for that one. Let's look at the other side here. Remember, all gluten-free, whatever that is, $7.68, $7.68, $8.98, $8.78, $8.98. Oh, oh, I tell you what, maybe anything gluten-free, look at this one, seven. $7.68 for this. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. Holy smoly, $7.68. I saw some of this shrimp, $13.42, and, and you get two pounds of it. Peeled the vein tail off large. It's a value bag, but where are they from? The shrimp, that's what I want to know. Product of India farm raised. So there you go, they're raised, they're raised in ponds, in little tiny fish ponds. I saw something that I used to buy years ago. This this banquet fried chicken. You buy it in a box, fourteen dollars and forty-eight cents. And this used to be right around five or six dollars at the most. Look at the price of this! Holy smokes, two pounds, ten ounces for fourteen dollars and forty-eight cents. That's ridiculous. Cornish game hens, ten dollars and fifty-four cents for two of these. And I remember seeing them not too long ago. They used to be two for five. Then I saw them two for seven. And now they're two for $10.54. So that's $5 each. Man, everything's just going up. And what do we have here? What is this, a duck? Oh, a baking hen, $11. Holy cow. Man, I tell you. Are they turkey or are they baking hen? $1.40 a pound. So I guess that's not too bad, right? $1.40 a pound. May not, might not be too bad. And here's a rock Cornish game hen, single, 372 and off brand. So there you go, that's not too bad, right? Compared to the Tyson. So you buy the brand name, the branded 1047 or 372 for just one. They've really been hit here at Walmart over the weekend. This is a Monday and, and the meat aisle's just been devastated. We'll, we'll check the prices as we go along here. Let me just scan it and take a look at this <laughs> but they still haven't put anything out here <laughs> nothing has been put out yet and and you can just go along the chicken aisle where the where are the chickens there isn't there isn't a single well there is there's a single piece right there leg quarters but it's just been wiped out then you get to the the processed foods and, and nobody wants those they just want to come down here to this stuff but look at the chicken just completely wiped out there isn't any anything to look at there's some turkey left but other than that, it's just been it's just been wiped out. Let's look at some of the pork. I want to get a Boston butt. My wife said she's gonna cook me cook me one next week. Two two boneless butt roasts, two ninety four a pound, twenty four dollars. This is less than two dollars at uh, at Walmart. I mean, at, I'm sorry, at Sam's Club. <laughs> I can't talk. What else do we have here? The pork chops have they come down in price? Oh my gosh, let me see. $4.04 .04 a pound. That's half price at Sam's. And let me see. Ribeye steaks. How much are these guys? $14.97 for these. $26 for two of them. Oh, a little pricey there. What else do they have? Even beef ribs are really pricey. And, and they're half fat and bone. $7.14. Man, I tell you. It's just the cost of everything these days. Man just I don't know how we're gonna survive this 
uh, carne, uh, what, I can't pronounce that, 598 shredded beef here, holy cow. And of course you have the beef in the tube and then all your hamburger and what is your lean ground beef price, I don't see it. $10.72 for what? I don't know. I can't see. The pricing is so mismarked here. $5.94 a pound for ground ground beef sirloin is what it looks like to me. Man, I tell you, the prices today. And nobody wants, right next to the empty chicken aisle, nobody wants these processed foods. Here, look at this chicken here. The, the price is so faded on here. $8.47. And this is... $4.94. I don't know if the price is faded or this is, but you know, $8.47 $8 for this, $4.46 for this. It looks like it's not in the right place to me. Nothing's in the right place. $3.48. $6.98 for one of these. My gosh, the prices on this stuff. $9.32 for this. It's one pound. $9.32 for this. $9.32. $8.98. $7.98. Bob Evans family size, $5.48, $4.12 for that, $4.12 for some potatoes right here. My gosh, everything is just going up. Let's check the bread aisle. Let's just check some of the the hamburger and hot dog buns. $3.78 for hamburger buns. Buns right here, $3.50, $3.50. It's hard to see if anything's in the right spot. $2.98 for that. Let's look here. What is this? Keto buns. What's a keto? <laughs> What's a keto bun? 590. 596? That can't be right. Let me see. 767. That's it. That's ridiculous. What's a keto bun? <laughs> oh my gosh. Of course, your Martins are $4. Still, still $4. Not coming down in price. Ballparks, 374. Oh my gosh. 352 for these ballparks. But if you look at the, the, the great value buns, they're $1.68. See, that's what I'd be going after is those guys. <laughs> Not the ballparks. I know they're better, but I certainly wouldn't be paying $4 for that. No way. And what are the Wonder Breads? Because I always wonder about these guys. Two, two ninety four. is that right? Uh, let me see. The uh, brioche. Everything's in the wrong spot. I can't tell. Where's the Nature's Own? This is it. Nature's Own three thirty three for the hamburger. And it must be the same for the hot dog buns, I would assume. You just can't. Okay, here it is the wonder. $2.58. See, it's hard to find anything in Walmart. And um, they don't look like they're a good seller. So uh, I'd stay away from them myself. But those are the prices of your buns. Everything's upwards of 3 to $4. The last time I was at the hunting, I, I looked at my video and I said, you know what, I saw some crazy prices right above here. And I didn't even point them out. I didn't realize it's $7.24. Then I looked at this raw almond butter, $16.84. Are you kidding me? $16.84 for raw almond butter for this little tiny thing. Holy smolies, what's crazy? $16.84. And this one's $6.94. So I don't know what the difference is. $6.94, $9.94. Six ninety four, six ninety four, five twenty two. These these prices, they're all over the board. Classic peanut butter. This doesn't look bad, but the price, holy smolies, just pricey. And even stuff on the top shelf, whatever these are, almond butter, crazy prices. I was looking at the cookies here, and they're still four fifty eight for all these Oreos. They're all four fifty eight, four fifty eight. And then I saw someone grabbing. A box of these and they're 92 cents and I, and I was really curious about these so these are 92 cents and he filled his hands up with these guys and I see that they're they're pretty popular 92 cents and there's a big box of them right up there so I'm gonna get one of these and try it I mean I was looking for a snack and it's 92 cents so I'm just gonna try one of these guys and all the, and then right next to the snacks I saw these little tiny cans of soda here 428 for these guys and they're just the little tiny cans a six pack of them and then you have the 10 cans 578 holy smolies every everything is 428 for these little guys just the prices on stuff 578 for the little tiny cans my gosh and my my favorite of these oreo thin mints but they're but they're 458 and you only get 13 ounces in here so uh 
I don't find it a bargain. This box here is $3.98 for these Orioles. The Nutter Butters, which are good. Another tiny box. Fudge covered Nutter Butters for $4.12. Pinwheels, no way. Pinwheels are $6.24. No way. Oh, holy smolies. These pinwheels are $6.24. That takes the cake. That's ridiculous. Chips Ahoy, 368. Something in here. Oh, that's the other Chips Ahoy. Everything's in the wrong spot here. But but the Oriole Thins, 458. I can't get over this though. Pinwheels, 624. No way. Pinwheels, $6.24. Are you kidding me? For cookies, look. $6.24. That's nuts. Here's some other crazy cookie prices. Lorna Dunes, no way, 10 ounces, this is it. It's 10 ounces of Lorna Dunes for $6. Oh, holy smolies, no way I grew up in these guys. They're delicious, but the price is nuts. That's just crazy. $6.12 for Lorna Dunes, can you believe that? That's nuts. Oh. I'm just randomly going through the, the aisles here looking at prices. Crackers like this, 334, 334, 334 Ritz, 352 for these guys. A 20 pack of what? Munchies right here, 882. Oh, it's the 20 pack of the Ritz for 882. Crackers right here, 598, 648 for these Cheez Its and these little packs right here, 598. Moon Pies, remember those? I don't think this is the right spot. Maybe it is 376. In lemon moon pies, 282. I've never tried those. They might be good, <laughs> but the price isn't all that bad. But what are these little cracker things? Remember these? These used to be a dollar. Now they're a, look at. They should be a. These are a dollar seventy-seven. Come on, that's ridiculous stuff. Soft baked cookies right here, 588. 588. Just crazy. Oh, I found myself another snack. It's it's a dollar thirty-two for these saltine crackers. I said I wanted a snack tonight, so this stuff tastes really good. You put a little bit of uh, real butter on here; it's fantastic. But a buck thirty-two, holy cow! I have to have a snack. Well, I hope everybody enjoyed the show tonight. Walking around Walmart, checking out the prices. I was shocked by the Lord of Dunes. It's just crazy. Inflation is still hitting us hard. So give me a thumbs up for like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Until next time, this is Scott with the Real Economy. We'll see you.